सो हेलो गाइस वेलकम अगेन प्लीज रीड द डिस्क्लेमर फर्स्ट सो दिस इज ऑल्सो फॉलो अप वीडियो ऑन बोथ दी वर्सन ऑफ कलाश निको एज आई प्रॉमिस यू नो टू गिव यू रिव्यू ऑन द परफॉर्मेंस ऑफ बोथ दी स्ट्रेटजीज सो दिस इज अ मॉडिफाइड वर्जन विथ ए टी आर कंडीशन इन बिल्ड एंड टूडे इट गेव अस अराउंड दिस नंबर ऑफ लॉस एंड दिस इज द ओरिजिनल स्ट्रैटी विच गेव अराउंड दिस नंबर ऑफ लॉस सो लेट्स सी ट्रेड्स वन बाय वन आई हैव ऑल्सो नॉट सीन टिल नाउ सो फर्स्ट इज यू नो लेट्स चेक दिस ट्राइक्स फोर्टी थ्री थ्री हंड्रेड फोर्टी थ्री टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी थ्री वन हंड्रेड एंड विथ मॉडिफाइड ऑल्सो इट सीम्स लाइक सेम स्ट्राइक्स and these both are call side trades and uh, this one is uh, put side trade so why is uh, you know it seems like all the trades are common so why uh, the difference of pnn so let's check that so let me check the timings of the trades so 1031 uh, this is modified version and here 1031 so it seems like uh, this is common trade between both so let's check this on chart so at uh, in this candle at 10:30 it triggered and after that it might have uh, you know given us sl because uh, this seems like this candle closed below this or this candle closed below uh, the sm at 10 so it seems like very trend as you can see uh, by the size of the candle here uh, atr is around 71 and our entry candle and sl value is around 96 so it comes below our entry criteria of modified version also In original version, we don't see uh, this ATR condition, so it will take trend as per the setup uh, without checking the ATR. So let's check another trade. So uh, first one was valid trade. Let's check another trade. It was at 12:44, uh, 45 with modified version, and uh, with original version, it was at also at 12:45. In PNL also uh, we should compare. So this is minus 3100, minus 2700. This is also. you know around around the same level you can say mm, this is exit at 1046 the first trade exit and uh, this is at 1046 only so it's the difference of uh, the ltp at that time of the option so difference uh, between these two uh, pnl are you know seems like uh, due to ltp differences uh, between uh, you know uh, the bid ask spread at that particular time so first one was a valid trade for both uh, for second trade 1245 Here also, twelve forty-five and exit at one one. So let's check that. Mm. So around this level, twelve forty-five, it took the trade on uh, call side, and uh, its SL got hit. Uh, it seems like uh, there is a uh, differences of values of moving averages. Uh, but, uh, this is the trade run provided chart only, but. Uh, Uh, we'll have to see in notification logs what were the values of uh, moving averages because as per this chart there was no trade uh, for call side mm. let me check if uh, no as per this chart there was no trade because uh, for the trade to be valid all the three moving averages should be below the closing price uh, so there must be you know moving average value differences between uh, what retro fetch and what is being shown here so for that we need to check notification low of 1245 this is i am doing because you know it helps you guys also to check whether if uh, you are facing any discrepancies so here you need to check for timings of 1245 it seems like on page 1 it's not there so click on page 2 and yes here our entry satisfied in this call so let's check the moving averages uh, value ltp was 431188 okay are i close to the that's all the fine uh, we need to check the moving averages value where is that yeah sma 10 value is 43139 and what's value here sma 10 okay you can check the value here so it is 43139 okay that's fine another thing is uh, uh, moving average close according to this previous candle close was 43188.9 mm, closing price you can see here 
43188.9 okay that's also fine another sma20 43135.97 so sma20 we need to see here 43135.97 okay that's also fine and sma50 43186.011 Okay, so here is the discrepancy between uh, this trading view chart and the Tretron fetch value uh, because Tretron has fetched the value of SMA50 as 43186 while here the value is 43193. So according to uh, trading view chart there is no trade here, there is no call set trade here but as uh, there is value discrepancy uh, between Tretron and trading view, Tretron has taken the trade according to logic. So we can't do much about uh, this uh, you know normal differences we have to accept that that uh, this was the call side uh, trade as per the tracton data and uh, we have to bear the loss so i have shown this to you guys because you guys also you know kind of uh, <coughs> get the uh, what should i say uh, the error in your code so don't always blame uh, the tracton for uh, the coding error that my strategy was working uh, fine like this for this many days and now it's uh, you know taking wrong entries wrong trades so at least check your entries with notification log and chart and see whether there is uh, any differences between values of indicators and uh, open high low close values so etc so uh, and this will happen because data provider will change data provider for trading view and data provider for trade run, uh, you know might be different so that's why it happened so now uh, let's take another last entry so it was on put side at 105 uh, in original strategy while uh, with modified strategy the last entry was at okay 115 so here might be the difference <coughs> because here it has given you know uh, good profit uh, around 1k difference of profit between these two trades here its profit is 150 only because uh, original strategy took entry earlier while the modified version took 10 minutes late entry so let's check at 115 and 105 <coughs> okay, so original strategy took entry here let's check the SL value and ATR values at this time 105 so this should be your SL highest high value and uh, range is 117 and the ATR value is 48 you can see ATR value here so ATR value at the time of entry uh, the previous candle of entry candle was at 48.14 so 48.14 into 2.3 so it's 1110 while the range was as I said was around you know around 117 or 119 so it's obvious that uh, ATR based uh, trade would skip this trade and after that again you know RSI went above 40 and then deep below 40 then uh, the SL is low our SL is lesser than uh, what was it here so it took entry and after that uh, when it book one lot at 1 is to 1 ratio and another lot at SMA uh, close of this candle above SMA 10 so this was the difference uh, this trade was the difference I can say between the two version uh, today another thing is here also our trade is satisfied as per chart but as you know the 50 sma value uh, was different here uh, also at uh, you know this time so it might be possible that it was different at this level also that uh, here on chart we can see that the candle has closed below all the three moving averages and rsi also have crossed below 40 at same candle so here it would have you know, it should have taken the trade and uh, it might also be a profitable trade as it has reached uh, easily one is to one risk reward ratio and another leg would have exited break even point but this happens uh, we can't do much about it so so i guess uh, this video was helpful so i'll probably make for few days also uh, this comparison video and after that we'll stop after that you i think you all can decide 
which uh, version you want most so this is it guys thank you see you in next video